Hello, hello everybody, Pause Life Gaming here. <clears throat> Welcome back to Delta Ruin, not Deltrune. I've been saying it wrong this whole damn time. God, that music is scaring me, and I'm really trying to up my microphone today, trying to get a little bit more. Turns out we got more than one save slot. Toby, I don't know what you're doing, but you know what? Let's continue where we were. Oh, let me turn that down a little bit. That's, uh, that's really loud. Okay. <clears throat> When we last left off, we got to this castle town. Very nice place. Not spooky at all with the geyser of darkness, but you know what? Let's go. Hey, look, it's our friend. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? You know, Jeanette, shut up. Actually, I actually forgot your name in the past two days. Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please come forward. Both of you. If this is a woman, I swear to God, I'm sorry. Are you the boat person from Undertale? Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris. Susie. There is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. Hell no. Just kidding. Yes, please. I would love to listen. <clears throat> Very well, then. We get this voice ready. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light. It was a legend of dark. This is a legend of Delta Ruin. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance. Bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror, and the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at the world's edge. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angels' heaven. Only then will balance be restored, and the world saved from destruction. Today, the fountain of darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Damn! I noticed that that signal you're talking about, the angel thing? Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I noticed that the, that symbol, like the one that's there, and you can't see my mouse because I don't record it. That's the same one that Asriel has, Asgore has, Toriel has, like the kingdom, the entire monster kingdom has. So, I know, I was told this isn't a sequel to Undertale, but it is heavily related. And I can see how. Well, I mean, it was made by the same creator, so no duh, but I like this. Let's continue. <clears throat> I deeply believe you two are heroes of the legend. That despite whatever enemies you may face, 
You two have the courage to save the world. Delta warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? <gasps> um, nah. Wh what? <laughs> Me? Some kind of hero or something? <laughs> You've got the wrong person. But, but Susie, without you, the world will. So what if the world gets destroyed? It's none of my damn business. It might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait. Well. Ho ho ho! The heroes are already running away. They didn't even know I was here. My dad's gonna make me son of the month! Who the hell are you? I'm... The bad guy! You clowns want to steal, want to steal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns. Save the world from eternal darkness? Huh! <laughs> uh... Don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it! Step one, I'll thrash you. Step two, you lose! Hmm, nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually, mind if we use it on you instead? Well, where do we get these weapons from? Lancer busts in. Halt! Halt, clams! The spike is fueled by victory! Oh! Okay. Don't know how I got an axe, but, like, that's cool. You tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. I love to get thrashed. Just kidding, that's you! Lancer is thinking about chips. So what are you guys doing after this? Lancer is thinking about chips. I'm the bad guy. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. All right, you punkaroos. I've had the luck of this of the draw this time, but next time, the losers will be you. <laughs> Bye, losers. I gotta be home before dinner. Mom's making chicken. You won. You got zero XP and thirty-nine dollars. Yeah, we robbed him. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am. Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Uh, um, all right. Hello, everyone. I'm Raziel. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm sorry, I actually had my voice synthesizer to make me sound cool inside the hood, and now you're probably going to pummel me because I sound like a kid who plays Fortnite all the time. I'm certain we're going to become great friends and play squads. I mean, no, 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 no. The best way to leave is east, right? I don't want to hang around with a Fortnite fuckwad like yourself. Yes, that that's where we'll uh got it. Susie wait <laughs> See you at school, Chris. Okay. But why'd you go north? I was like this. 
Ah, I'm drinking some wonderful uh, uh, chocolate. Oh, it's, yeah. Um, I suppose it's just the two of us then. Yeah, don't worry, I'm mute. Chris, I'm a prince, but I um, certainly don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Alright, you know what? I want to see what's over here. Okay, nothing. Hey, Chris. I really think we should catch up with Susie. We can come back here after our adventure is over. And then I can bake you a yummy cake! Yay! I like cake. You know, I'm really liking this game so far. Raziel, the lonely prince, is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys shines within you. Okay, so I was told by the end of this game I should record with a face cam. If you guys would like me to do that, say that so in the comments. I would love to uh, do something like that. Er, uh, Chris? You know you can hold X to run. Oh, I thought it was shift. Really? Right. You'll move faster by holding X. And I'll be right behind you, so don't worry. Unless you want to get away, which in case, sorry. So I can do that, but I can also press shift. Yeah. Oh yeah, we went this way. Whoops. Toby, you've outdone yourself with the music again. I love music. <laughs> oh, Chris! It's the training dummy I made! I know! Now, it seems like a great chance to prepare for the enemy. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? Uh, Sure, I'm kind of not that good with it right now. Get ready, Chris! See the heart, Chris? That's your soul! The cum... The cumulation of your being. Within it holds your will. Your compassion. Your lust. And fate, not, not lust. What was I talking about? Of the world. If it gets hit, and your friend... You and your friends will lose HP. Everyone's HP reaches zero. Oh, if everyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So... Please take care to avoid the enemy's attack. Ready? Let's try dodging. Wow. What? Great job, Chris. You're a natural. Anyhow, after the enemy attack, it's our turn. First, I'll teach you how to fight. Though, well, fighting is unnecessary in this world. There's no harm in a thorough lesson. Yeah. Okay, so it's just like Undertale. Wow, Chris! That was an amazing attack! Have you done this before or something? Huh. Huh. <laughs> More than you think, buddy. Let's try defending. Simply defend, and the enemy's attack will hurt you less. Not only that, but you'll also gather TP. Toilet. Watch the orange big bar to the left. I'll explain it next. Oh, defending's way up here. Okay. Great job, Chris. Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one of my spells? Oh! Because you hit the enemy enough, I got it got tired. Now, if I use my my pacify spell on it, it'll fall asleep and will win peacefully. Oh! Raziel cast pacify. Great, Chris. We would have won the battle by now. Now I just have a little more to teach you. Acting, though this, even even the most violent enemies, can be defeated through various acts of kindness. Chris, though it's just a dummy, why not give it a hug? You hug the dummy. Aw, that's great, Chris. Each, each enemy has different acts that satisfy them. When an enemy is satisfied, its name turns yellow. When that happens, you can defeat it by sparing it. If we spare all the enemies we meet, we'll never have to fight. Chris spared the dumb. Great job, Chris! That'll be the end 
That'd be the end in a real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you, Chris. Okay. So I have a feeling he was just saying... One second. He was just saying... If we can peacefully do everything, we won't have to fight. Is this gonna be like Undertale? Where there's a neutral, a genocide, and a pacifist route? Cause I wanna try that now. Oh crap, I forgot to read what that was. Oh well, you guys have more than enough time to read it. I'm sorry, I didn't get to you. And, uh, in case you ever need a refresher, I... Here, I wrote a manual. I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press C to open the menu and use it in your items. You got the menu. Whoa! Oh my! The great door is opened? No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold exactly by the prophecy. But Chris, I believe your choices are important too. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how we treat them makes all the difference. So, let's try our best to get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Um, I'm sorry, is that too much to ask? Oh, I'm sorry. Chris, in the end, what you choose is up to you. As long as you're happy with it, I'm happy too. So just try your best and don't worry. I hope you guys enjoy the voices that I make. I am I mean, I could read it all. If you guys don't want me to make voices, if you're like, Ew, it's really annoying that he does different voices for different characters. Just tell me, I'll speak normally like I do, like I see a lot of YouTubers do. I don't see many people do voices for characters, so that's why I like to do it. I just think it's fun. Oh, okay. But if you guys don't like the voices, tell me in the comments. Actually, no, here, I'm gonna put a card up in the top right corner. I'm gonna have a card and I want you guys to vote. Do you want me to do the voices? Do you want me to stop them? Let me know, because I really want some feedback. With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. The power of adventure shines within you. Whee! I really enjoy worlds like this. The feel of hopes and dreams! <gasps> hopes and dreams! That was a song! Enemies ahead. You're gonna die. Signed, Lancer. Pfft. <laughs> ah! Aw. Rudin drew near. Rudin drew near you. You lectured the enemy on the importance of kindness. The enemies became tired. <sighs> what? Okay. Oh, I was not looking. Rudin is is starting to fall asleep. Lecture again. You lectured on the importance of kindness. The enemy became tired. Raziel cast Pacify. You won! Zero XP, thirty-one dollars. Is the XP stand for execution points again? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna kill something. And I'm gonna test it out. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. I think I should re be reading the signs in Lancer's voice. Don't read this sign. It's a work in progress. <laughs> if 
it isn't my two favorite people. Psych, you guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? <laughs> you fools, you're too late to stop me. What did you do? <laughs> it was so simple. She beat me up, so I ran away. That's a bit anticlimactic. These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Whenever you do, don't check the tree and use C to open your menu. You got it? So, there are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one? You got the dark candy. There's the candy hanging from the tree. Take one? Yes. You got the dark candy. There's nothing hanging low enough to take. Okay. Those are healing items. Hey, you don't have to head that way. My troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? <laughs> I remember to think of it as an invitation. Fight me. I'm going to kill you this time. Okay, wait. Lecture. Important kindness. The enemies became tired. Ugh, what? Okay. Just a normal person. Ah, oh, I took some damage. Okay. Rudin is starting to fall asleep. This one. Raziel cast Pacify. Shine, shine. Ruin is starting to fall asleep. You won! Got 0 XP and $63. He has 40 HP, a red and black star that tastes like marshmallows. Um... Are you cheese? Mamma Miba! I'm Top Chef! My latest cake worked me to exhaustion! So I took a little nap, but Mamma Miba! A scary noise woke me up! A beast was hunched on the table, leading the cake like an animal! I spiritualized it with water, and it hissed and ran off! But my wonderful cake is. Aww, Chris, that sounds like Susie! We must be going the right way! Let's try to keep her out of any more trouble. I'm a... I'm a... You know that beast? Please don't come back! The remnants of a cake are still smoldering. Take a piece. The broken cake was added to your key items. Can we go up here? No, that's just the wall. Okay. Can I just run around you? Damn it. And Rudin and Happy block the way. I guess that makes sense. Smells like a soft kiss. Chris spared Rudy. Razriel spared Happy, but his name wasn't yellow. Oh! Whoops! Flatter. You adored Razriel to flatter all the enemies. We don't need XP. Just encountering your smile was, is a reward enough. Aww. Happy has a little secret. Chris spared. You won! Zero XP and 66 D dollars. 66... Wait. Another one? 
tell you. Oh, okay. Check the clock in order to solve this puzzle. You'll have to hurry. What? Oh, okay. Behold the maze of death! Prepare to get lost, clowns! So I'm trying to cut these down to like 40 minute segments. Some sort of enemy looks like they got clobbered. Feeling lost yet? You must be utterly helpless among these twists and turns. Your sense of direction won't save you now. Hey, wait it! Where am I? Help! Somebody help! I'm lost! Signed Lance. Oh crap, my headphone fell out. <laughs> Signed Lance. You opened the treasure chest and inside was white ribbon. You put white ribbon in your armor. That ribbon is armor, Chris. It increases defense. Why don't you try wearing it in the equipment menu? I think it'll look great on you. Ability, cuteness. Dead end, dead end, dead end. Dead end. Yeah, I may as well read it, that's what I've been doing. Hey! Don't look, this sign's private! <laughs> oh! It's just this way! Oh! <laughs> Somehow you survived the maze! Don't count your blessing before they hatch! Let's see how you fare against this team! You would advise you to flatter all the enemies. I'm making tea later, um, would you like any? Hey, hey, hey! Why aren't you guys thrashed? You're totally outnumbered. We made a team purely of support enemies. Their bullet patterns aren't balanced at all. It's like a dinner made of made of three glasses of milk. And that's mm, usual somehow. Why don't we talk about this after the battle? Spared. Spared. Go. Sweet! How much do I get? You lost, Lancer. You don't get any. Oh. Can I have some of yours? No. Fine. <laughs> Later, losers. Sup? Thought you were running away. Yeah, I finished. I don't get it. Ugh. Open, you stupid door! Oh, great, it's you guys. Susie, we were ever so worried about you. Um, how'd you get past those spikes before? Walk through them? But this door sucks. Aw, don't worry, Susie. It'll open after we solve the puzzle over there. Nice. Tell me when you finish it. Um, Susie, we need you to finish it. Sometimes proceeding will take all three of us. 
Furthermore, only Chris can seal the dark fountain. So if you don't accompany us, you won't make it home. So you're saying I have to stick with you guys? Yep. <sighs> Let's get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back on the team. Cue the fanfare. Susie joined the team. Oh, the party. Susie follows at a distance such that no one can tell she's associated. Okay, this is gonna be painful to do. Aha! Okay, I thought we were gonna be like, what the, what the fuck? Oh, Chris, I just realized Susie missed the tutorial. Next battle, we should show her how to act. I think she might really enjoy that. What, are you a. Hello? Okay. See round attack violently. You recall Razriel's advice to include Susie in on act. And you ordered Susie to fly to the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? It attacked us! Let's smash it before it moves! Well, look, Susie, it seems harmless. If you act nice, we might win without hurting it. Okay, okay. Hey, little guy. I really like that axe in your face. Where'd you get it? <laughs> um, Chris, maybe I should talk to her. Oh my. Um, Susie, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? Um, what if you just took it easy on them? If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which I can put exhausted people to sleep. <sighs> yeah. You talking is already doing that. Well, um, just think about it. I have to warn enemies about the curse. You Italian? Hey! Hey, kid. You wanna buy a tutorial? It's only 50 dark dollars. <laughs> Did I say 50? Well, it just went on sale. 20! 20 dark dollars. One! Only one dollar, please. Please, I need this right now. Really? You changed your mind? <laughs> Alright, this way, gentlers. Whole goals. One dollar monthly tutorial weekly. Ten dollar weekly tutorial monthly. A hundred dollars stop making tutorials. We're sorry, we're uh, normally puzzle guys, but we've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. The king got power. He fired everyone and replaced all puzzle makers with him. Rulex card. Lord of the puzzles, be careful. Um. Bye. I don't understand. Donation hole. If you like our tutorials, please throw your money into the hole. You put a dollar in the hole. The hole became full. I'm Chris Master. Ask me about Chris. Oh, it tells me. Okay, so that tells me about Chris. That's about Susie. You're about. Yep. What are you a tutorial for? I'm TP. Okay, I know a lot of this stuff already. Uh, 
Okay. Let's go to the shop. Holy crap! <laughs> Welcome, travelers! Don't have anything better to do? <laughs> so you are the heroes who are going to seal our fountain. <laughs> Good luck, it makes no difference to me. Neither light nor door can hold a future for a darker in my condition. The junk you got. Uh, thanks for that. You got. You got the dark candy, dark burger, amber card, armor, defensive charm, spooky silver. We sell that wooden sword. Okay. I'd like to have all of those. I'm going to save. Susie the Violet. Tormentor is now your ally. The power of the mean girl shines within you. And that is where I'm going to end this episode at. Nearly 38 minutes after this outro, it might be 40. Anyway, thank you all for watching this episode of Delta Rune. Oh my god, I forgot the name. If you really liked it, please consider hitting that like button. It really helps out. Not that much. It just helps my ego. It makes me think I'm, I'm loved. Hit that subscribe button if you're new and you want more of this. I really love 8-bit games like this, and I really want to get back into streaming soon. I will start doing streaming again, but uh, that was great. So remember to take a break, pause your life, and play a game. I will see you all. Oh my god. I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>